Hello everyone and welcome back to Total Aviation. In today's video I will show you how to make an MSFS delivery from scratch. I would like to say a massive thank you for the amount of support the first delivery tutorial got. I can't believe it has grown to become the top video on the channel and the best video I have made. I have received over 200 comments and many messages through DMs on Discord about questions linked to that tutorial and I have absolutely loved the support and helping you create your own custom livery. I have created 10 episodes for our first series of Mastering the Art of Livery Painting in Microsoft Flight Simulator. Now, this is the first episode. This episode is titled The Livery Setup. The Livery Setup will be downloading all the tools you require to get started. Now, this tutorial series will be basic. So if you don't know Blender, if you don't know Photoshop, if you don't know GIMP, pay attention, take this video very slowly and I will walk through all the steps you need. There has been loads of comments that stand out about the old tutorial and some will pop up on screen now. In this tutorial series, we'll be covering how to convert liveries to the fly by wire, how to create a coffee cup for the fly by wire, how to paint on the engines and the bottom of the airplane, how to design lines on the airplane livery, like straight lines without the brush in Blender, and many more episodes. So, let's get started. First step is downloading everything. If you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe, like, and share this video. This series has taken a while to produce, so please make sure you subscribe. You can also follow me at on Twitch, where I live stream daily. The old tutorial got 37k views. That is an amazing number, and thank you so much for the amount of support you have given that first series. Step one, download. The first one, application you want to be installing is Blender. Now, you don't want to be installing the latest Blender. What you want to install, you want to go to release notes, download these versions, and you want to find Blender 2.92, and you want to MSI install it. Now that will install. I won't install it because I already have it. The next thing you want to download is GIMP. Again, download GIMP directly and GIMP will install. If you want to use paint.net, you can do the same and download it .dn and it will download. The next one you want to do is MFS to Blender to MSFS. Now, this might show for main. What you want to do is rewrite and then download zip. Now while that downloads, if if anyone's using Photoshop, you have to make sure you've got NVIDIA Texture Tools Exporter. And you can download it by Adobe plugin here. And you log in. Next stage, now we have that downloaded. This has got the MFS to Blender. So we're gonna extract that. And here we go. Now, once you've done to this stage, you want to find where you installed Blender version. Now, I have made a shortcut, but I'm going to show you if you don't know where it is. So if you go to this PC and follow it, it should be in Program Files, Blender, Blender 2.92 and 2.92 now what we're going to be doing is yeah we've got our rewrite and we're going to go add-ons this is what we want to be installing into here you have to do this manually you click on scripts add-ons and you want to either control c 
or drag it and make sure it's got moved to add-ons. Now it's going to replace this because I've already done it. But if it says replace, you just want to click replace. And you want to do this for all. And there it go. And that you have installed the Airs First plugin. Now what we're going to be do is opening the model. So we can go and click Blender. Search Blender and open Blender. You can see it's 2.92. Okay. So Blender will open up like this. What you want to do is drag and click delete. We go to preferences, add-ons, and we want to type in MSFS. And you want to tick it. So I'm just going to tick it again. You can leave this, you can fill it in if you'd like to. But for this tutorial, you will not need it. The next thing you want to do is you want to go and import it. So import MSFS here. Now at this step you want to go to your model. Now if you don't know where this is, in the description there will be file paths on where you can get this. But I know where mine is, so MSO first, special and steam, and we're going to search A320 Neo, sim objects, airplanes, Airbus A320 Neo, model, and you want to make sure it's LOD00 and go import. Now this may take a moment, Blender might crash, but it will load up like this. Now that is messy, that is messy for us livery creators to design livery. So we're going to have to clean it up. So in the next stage we're going to hide environment parts. So parts that are not needed is where you can see it says frosted there. Don't need the frosted part. Don't need a livery official as well. We can start clicking when it says official. We don't want that. Uh, we don't want frosted. We want to click on things, and if it says livery official or frosted, we want to get rid of it. Now, if you don't want to do this. And if you're a Patreon member, you can download this template on your Patreon membership if you got the first class membership. Just want to make sure you keep doing that. Just making sure where it says frosted. And you want to make sure it doesn't say frosted. Okay. Okay. Right. Now, once you get to this stage, now when you get to the stage, hold shift down and click the parts you want. So you want the engines, we want the wings, move it around, back door there, elevators, elevators, and make sure we grab the door there. And what's about this? stage you do shift and hitch. If you've done it correctly your model should look like this. And now you are ready to get started painting. This will be the end of episode one and we will continue the series in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this episode. Please join our Discord server for more livery resources under our paid memberships. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.